Hello everyone, it's the Breet. Today I have a very exciting new addition to show you and a new release. So I actually bought this item uh, a day before I was supposed to, apparently. Um, but something very exciting has come out. We have recently learned within the past few weeks that Gigapets are back. So, ta-da! Gigapets AR, which um, the AR stands for Augmented Reality. And uh, what's interesting is this is actually put out by a company called Top Secret Toys. So at first you may be looking at this and thinking, oh, you know, somebody bought the rights to the name and started making it. Actually, uh, the original team that made these and the original designer is with this company. So um, it, it's actually really neat. They created the Giga Pets and Tiger picked it up. And so they were really the distributors of the toy. And um, those Giga Pets that we had come out in the 2000s were like Hasbro's really crappy attempt at recreating the Giga Pet hype. But uh, now we have the Gigapets AR brought out by the original creators. So I have so much hope for this. Um, just for anyone who hasn't seen uh, the videos or read any history that I've wrote about my personal collecting story is uh, back in 1997 was when I got my first pet when we could actually find them here in the Midwest, not completely sold out. Um, I was very excited. I saw that Kmart, which is now gone in our area, had uh, a sale going on on Giga Pets. I had been wanting a virtual pet so bad, and we walked in, I walked up to the shelf in the toy section, made a beeline straight for it, saw a freshly stocked shelf full of Giga Pets. The worker at the time had said, um, that they had just stocked them and they wouldn't be out there for very long and I am 33 and I will never forget the feeling of reaching up and grabbing my Compu Kitty. Um, it was just a really exciting time. The Giga Pet line and that particular virtual pet which I still have uh, really started my collecting days and I never really stopped being into virtual pets even when I first got on eBay in the year 2000, I was buying them much to my friend's surprise. They all thought I was crazy. So the my obsession with virtual pets really started here with Giga Pets. This is so exciting. So anyway, back to the pet now. So this team's come out with these. They are coming out with more uh, this month. This is the first one that's available. Um, the last one of the last times I looked, they were doing their second or first or second back order, I believe. But you can actually get these from their website, Top Secret Toys. Um, it's uh, gigapetsar.com. You can find the uh, listing there. They have the puppies that are currently released now and for sale. They will have the T Rex and Unicorn coming out within the next few weeks. I think the T Rex is coming out at the end of this month and um, the unicorn a little bit after that. So, and they're, they're really planning to do a lot more releases and different pets, so this is so, so exciting, especially for those of us who remember these and loved these from the 90s. And uh, something that we learned from the company that I am really thrilled about is that one of the members of the team is actually the man who originally programmed and created and, des and designed these, so I... I am so, so happy to see these back. And um, anyway, so the new things that they have is that this, the programming's slightly different. There's new animations, and from what I've seen from their Instagram, the new animations are just adorable. So, uh, but now you can scan these with your app on your phone. It's available on I iOS and Android, and you can actually see a 3D rendition of the animal. So you can actually do a test with it before you open up the package, so... We'll just pull up my phone here. So, um, there we go, I did my face. So, I've already got the Gigapets AR app here. I've already got it downloaded and installed. 
So we're going to say, okay, you can access that. Yes. So it says, would you like to experience the package? Try me. So we're going to say yes. Yes, I do have package. Okay. Going to give it permission for my camera. All right, let's see. Woo! It's got some, oh, okay, there's our dog. So let me push this up a little bit, get my, some of my nail polishes out of the way here. So the dog got really close to the screen, it looks like. Uh, okay, it wants me to push this a little further away, which is hard to do with this camera in particular. <laughs> so we can kind of see through the dog at that point, but now you can see the dog's doing a little dance. So there's different animations and different things that you can do with the pet. So before we get into too much of the app part, um, I'm going to actually open this. So uh, the only thing with this packaging is that it's on the paper card, which makes opening these a pain. So because it, at least with the old packaging, you can kind of cut up the plastic side and then pop it out and keep all your packaging intact. So uh, opening these is a little bit of a pain, so either a razor blade or an epoxy or a knife. Um, so I'm normally not allowed to have these because I am so clumsy that I usually tend to cut myself. So, all right, let's try this. So I've seen other people struggle with uh, this part if they don't cut it out. So I'm going to start up here, and what I'm going to try to do is go in from the side with this X-Acto knife and hopefully I will not slice myself open. Okay, I'm gonna hope that that's enough. Um, luckily I did not cut myself so far, so um, the instructions are under here, so I just did a little bit because I feel like most of this is going to pop up. So, let's see. Oh, did I not cut enough? Okay, I don't think I did. I think we're going to have to start going up around the top of this. For some reason, this does not want to slide along this top very well. I did the rest of it just by dragging, but I've noticed that for some reason... This right here is a little stubborn. Okay. There we go. All right. Managed to get that out. Um, yeah, it looks like the instructions are just going to slide out, but I'm going to leave those there because these are actually available online to see the online version, and I will have these up on the website, so make sure that you check for uh, the manual on vpets.org so I will have those up Let me get this dangerous object out of the way so now we have our gigapet dog or puppy as they say so I've got this little tab here let's see if I can get a hold of this and pull it Oh, that was cute. So it's got the dog barking. Now, I know that there are some review vid videos online. Um, I tried not to look at too many because I was really excited about getting a little bit of a surprise myself. So let's zoom in a little bit here. There we go. So let's see. We'll do a couple hours beforehand. That way, if this thing w wakes up early like Tamagotchis do, I don't have to be dealing with this at like 7 a.m. Okay, oh gosh, name, I didn't even think about this. Um, let's see, let's name this dog after one of my dogs from when I was a kid. Uh, looks like if you go backwards there's actually a check mark too. I wonder if that's a confirmation. Oh, it's got the basket like it originally did. Oh, I love that that's still in there. 
Um, the original Giga Pets, they'd be in a little tiny basket and they would come out. So that's great. Uh, that's really, really cute. I'm glad that that was kept. So let's see. It looks like this is a food icon, sleep, game. So it looks like a lot of the icons are similar to some of the older ones. So they're very recognizable. Guessing that's discipline, which they looks like they've moved that to the top now. Oh, it looks like he was very mad. Okay, there's a little phone icon, so that's how we connect to the app. Uh, looks like we've got the bathtub. Um, I'm gonna guess this is status, like the old one. Training. He keeps bashing his face into the screen. You poor thing. And a hand. Hmm. Okay. So let's see. You, let's see what they start out with. Okay, they do start with some points like the old one. Oh, they start out with a lot more. And the old ones, they would start out with zero. So he's got a little bit of hunger, which is kind of funny because if you think about it, it's like, oh, wait, I adopted a puppy that, uh, or an animal that is like basically starving. So it's kind of uh, a little more realistic there. So, okay, so looks like we can train him. And then, so the old style of the Giga Pets is that we would usually try to train them, then feed them regular food. So, let's see what kind of tricks we've got here. Okay, we've got Bark, so let's see if we can get him to bark. He is not in the mood. Well, guess what? I'm going to make you bark. Don't sniff. All right. I don't care if you don't want to. I'm going to make you. Ha ha, force you. There we go. Oh my goodness, would I be a terrible, terrible mother <laughs> to a dog? It's like, you have to do tricks. Okay, it looks like we unlocked something because the phone icon came up, so we'll look at that in a second. But okay, so I fed him a food or a treat, so let's see if that's still worth five points like it used to be. Oh, looks like rewards are free. That's interesting. Okay. So, uh, in the old models, the uh, any treat, even if it was a reward, was worth five hunger fill and the food was worth 20. So, um, kind of interesting if they've changed that. So, let's do roll over. Oh. I don't think the dog's too smart if he's going to keep ramming his face into the screen. Too bad. You have to do the trick anyway. Oops. Oh well, he got some discipline on that one. Now, I don't know if this is the same. I'll have to do some testing, but in the old one, once they were taught the trick, you didn't have to give them the reward every single time, which kind of helped if you were trying to train them that you weren't filling them up on treats. But since these are free, I'm imagining it's not going to be as big of a deal. Okay, I don't know if he wants to do these tricks, but we're going to make him. There we go. Oh, that was cute. Okay, you get your bone. Uh, something I'm noticing is that these buttons are very responsive. This is really nice. Uh, some of the old Giga Pets, you would get uh, some dust under the buttons, and then, oh, it was so hard to press. Uh, one of them that was really notorious for it was the koalas, which was hard, because the koalas, to get them to climb up the tree, which was the game, you had to go back and forth between these two buttons at like a very specific rate. And that was very difficult. Okay, hoop. Okay, that's obviously him sniffing, so that's not what we want. I imagine hoop is not smashing your face into the screen. So we're going to try this again. Oh, ran through a little hoop. Okay, you get a, a, a reward. And I'm imagining every time this is ringing, that means because we have unlocked something else. So I imagine if we look at the app here in a minute, that it means that we have unlocked new things. Okay, so it looks like we've got three tricks that we've learned. So he already did one trick on command, the bark, when we accidentally selected that. So let's see. Okay, it looks like discipline didn't go up much. So I don't know if this is an instant gratification thing like the old ones. Let's try roll over since he knows it. Okay. So he gets his reward. He did his trick. Hmm. Interesting. Guess we'll have to find out exactly how we raise discipline if tricks aren't really going to be the thing. So there's a new little puzzle to figure out there. 
Okay, so now let's go ahead and see what the food is. So we've got bowl of dog food and a bone. So if we feed him a bowl of dog food, let's see if that raises his hunger at all. Looks like we've got a new animation. So let's go back to our menu here. Okay, so the looks like the food is still worth 20 points, just like in the old games. Looks like we're getting a little more health here, getting a little more happiness. So we're making good progress here. Uh, we don't want to overfeed him. So he's at 90. If the food is worth 20, I'm not going to feed him again because uh, in the old games, at least, if you overfed, that's when you would get the fatter characters. So uh, we'll wait on that. I don't think he's ready to sleep yet, so let's check out the game here. Okay, oh, well, looks like we've got more than one game. Some kind of frisbee. A bouncing ball. So let's see if we can figure out the frisbee. Woo! Nope, I didn't press. I'm imagining you press left or right. Let me see if we can get the timing on. No! I wonder if we press these middle ones instead. I'm sorry, dog. I'm failing you. All right, let's try this again. Maybe we keep press. Oh, no, 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 I pressed the wrong way anyway. Uh-oh. I'm not doing well at this. Okay, I tried to press and hold. That didn't do it. We may have to look up instructions here in a second because... Okay, so I if I press it fast enough... All right. Okay, so we just have to keep pressing it multiple times and quickly. Oops, I did the wrong way. Oh, okay. So you can hit it once accidentally on the wrong way and it'll still do it. So, okay. That's that game. Let's see. Let's try this bouncing ball. Oh, uh, chase it. This kind of reminds me of the Nanos. Oh, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Oh, am I not doing Oh, there we go. Okay, he got it. Uh-oh. I'm going to guess he pooped because I see this flashing. Or are you just dirty? Yeah, you are a dirty little dog. Okay, so that was the bath. Let's see how our score is doing. Oh, our score is going up. Oh, we went down 10 points in food. That was very fast. Hmm, I wonder if this is going to be... Oh, look at how fast our health went up. So this definitely did not go up anywhere near this fast on the old ones. Uh, I did hear that these were made a little simpler to play than the old ones. Um, I... I liked the difficulty of the old ones personally, so um, that's not something that um, I would be unhappy seeing come back. So, okay, now that we've done the game, I'm going to guess this is discipline, which... Oh, it's the vet! A sad face is the vet. My goodness. Okay, doesn't look like you got the little vet animation other than the ambulance this time. Okay, and then the last one is this hand. Uh, are we just straight up going to smack the dog? Or maybe, okay, is that shake? Okay, I think that's shake. Good. That was actually one of the bad things about some of the old Giga Pets was that you can actually smack your pet. Oh, which is terrible, but funny, but not. Oh, God. So, okay, it looks like um, our discipline... I, I went right past it. Yeah, okay, it looks like our discipline did go up, so... Looks like that helps. So um, I'm going to set the camera up so we can get a better look at the toy and the animations. So I'll be back with that. Okay, so it looks like the first option it's giving us is to choose a style. So I'm not going to go with the typical Dalmatian. Oh, if anybody knows my obsession with uh, Calico Cats, that's a close one. Let's see. Oh. Looks like we can choose the individual pattern as well. <laughs> A dog covered in hearts, oh my goodness. It's like little lightning bolt-like things. Ooh, the stars, I might have to do the stars. I love stars. Let's see, swirlies, splatter. Oh God, can you imagine if you made those red? Oh, that's morbid. <laughs> uh, diamonds, yeah, I like the diamonds. Butterflies, hello 1996. Oh, little paws. Kind of just looks like your dog was in the middle of a crowd and got trampled by a bunch of other dogs. Let's see. I'm guessing these are like moon crescent shapes. Oh, I like that. The triangles. Those are nice. Arrows to confuse your dog on which way he's going. Oh, Lord. Tribal. 
Looks like your your dog went and got some bad tattoos. Bones. Because apparently, you know, I guess what, like the human equivalent would be like if I got cupcakes tattooed on me. And flowers. Okay, I think I'm going to go for the stars because... Oh, I love stars. Okay. Okay, we can choose the color of the pattern. Let's see. I like teal, so I'm going to make a dog that can't possibly exist. I'm going to go with teal stars. And... Hmm... Let's see. The white doesn't really go. Ooh, that's kind of funky. Kind of freaky, too. Let's see. Maybe we can go very contrasty and make it like an orange. Woo! That is a weird looking dog. Let's do it. Okay, let's make it like an orangey color. I like that. Okay, we're gonna say done. Yes! Okay. Even though this is not remotely what Kulo looked like. Okay, looks like we've got some activities here, so we can hit play. Oh. Okay. Let's throw a ball. Pew! Oh, look at the barbecue. There's a barbecue in the corner. Good boy. Oh, we can earn coins. Looks like we can shop in the shop, so that's fun. Let's see. Ooh, we can feed you. So it's almost kind of like having a secondary pet in your phone. Oh, oh, you tap it repeatedly to be able to fill up the bowl. That is a lot of food, dog. Ooh, we have enough coins. Let's buy something. Let's see. We've got 230 coins. Oh, it's going to make us buy something. Okay. It's going to make us buy a collar. You don't have a choice. You've got to buy what we want you to buy. Okay, so we can play games. Uh-oh, there's poop! Eh, we have to touch the poop! I don't have gloves on! Oh, I have to touch it more than once. <laughs> okay, it may get sick if we don't clean up the poop. Look at all the coins we're getting. Oh, did he get sick? I guess he did. Or we just have medicine on hand. Because he looks like a healthy dog, so what happens if I tap- oh. I get coins if I tap you. Oh, looks like my phone's on mute. No wonder we weren't hearing anything. Let's see if we can turn this up a little bit. I was at work earlier, so now it makes sense that we're not hearing much. Okay, let's hear you. Oh, it's just more like the coin sound. Ooh, this is super quiet. Let's see. I don't know, maybe it's mine that's just super quiet. Yeah, the dog's barking, but it's it's pretty quiet. Let's see if we've got something in the options that... Hmm. Yeah, it doesn't seem very loud. Looks like my... Oh. Hmm. Okay, let's bring this back and let's see what that does. Yeah, not very loud. So that might have something to do with my phone, but maybe it's just because I haven't started in a while. Let's see. Let's look at tricks. Okay, we're going to tell you to roll over. Uh, we'll have to make a loud sound. Hello! <laughs> Sorry for those who have headphones on if that was really loud. <laughs> okay. Oh, I wonder, f I wonder how much it takes to fill him up. Gosh, giant bowl like that. Woo, we have 20 coins! Okay. Let's look at, ooh, we've got poop. Gotta go back, we got poop. Looks like it makes it smaller, so I guess you scoop out a little bit of the poop with one tap or something. Okay, let's see, games. We've got toss, the toss boss, sweet dreams, pooper scooper. Okay, let's see. Gonna toss bones. Pew. Oh, did I not do it? Pew. This is also the sound I make whenever I throw my cat's toys. Pew. Uh-oh. No. Oh, we're gonna go even farther. Ah! Wonder if speed has something to do with it. It might. Because you can only go so far on the phone. Okay. No! 
Okay, we're not doing too bad. Not doing too bad. Okay. I'm not getting the bone. Oh my goodness, dog. How many of these bones can you eat? Oh, well. Looks like I was timed and I sucked, so. But we got 60 coins out of that, so that's not too bad. Okay, let's see. Sweet dreams. Oh, we have to make sure that it has only good dreams. You gotta admit, it's a pretty awesome looking dog. Are these bad dreams? I'm gonna guess the red ones are bad dreams. Ah, die! Die, bad dreams! You're not gonna touch my dog! Die! Wait, so if I can't keep up, does he like have night terrors or something? That'd be kind of terrible. Watch your dog writhe from night terrors, good god. Yay! Okay, we didn't have night terrors. Oh, yes, let's scoop some poop. I do that with cats a lot. Scoop. Oh, gotta hit it twice. Hey, don't go off the screen. That's not fair. I hope there's none off the screen that I can't see. Oh, no! He's dropping more. Oh, my goodness. Dog, what have you been eating? Three poops. Look at all the stinks that come up when you tap it. Turds. Can't even make this fertilizer. You just have to put it in the garbage and the poor garbage man has to cart off your poop. More poop. Okay, looks like we gotta do one more. Woo, 100 coins. Quick on your feet. Throw the ball to give your pet some exercise. Okay. Oh. Looks like there's different balls. I wonder if they do different things. So they're for different prices. Woo! We earned coins with that. Okay. So if we look in the shop, looks like we can buy... Ooh, we can buy treats. Oh, okay, if you tap it, it automatically buys it. It's not something that you can actually look into. Okay, so the customize is where you can actually buy things to put on your dog. Which, bunny ears wouldn't be bad. Here, Kulo, you get bunny ears. Ah, you did the poop! Okay, yeah, we're going to give you bunny ears. Oh, that one took almost three taps to get that. Okay, looks like care. I'm gonna guess this is like the. Ve oh, okay, bath. Discipline and doctor. Let's give him a bath. Ooh, gotta scrub you. Look how dirty you are. Look at all. You're like a pig pen over here. With all your little dust molecules in the air. Scrub, scrub, scrub. Ooh, gotta rinse you. Get the hose out. Ooh, gotta tap. There was a money in that bubble. Okay, looks like he's in pretty good shape. So let's check out the AR part. Okay, so if we line this up, oh, it looks like my dog's sleeping. Okay, so let's do, oh, looks like our dog pooped. So let's clean up that poop real quick. And then let's go to the AR app. Okay, so looks like we've unlocked the one with him with a bone. Not the bed. Catching a ball. Oh, doctor. Is the doctor a monkey? Oh, okay, we gotta see this. Please tell me the vet is a gorilla. I can't tell if it's a gorilla or just like a really ugly man. Okay, let's, yeah. Okay, we don't hit enter, we just hit, oh, no. Okay, okay, how do we do this? All right, I got this lined up. Oh, we gotta get that close on it. Okay. Oh, he laid down. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Okay, it just looks like he went into the vet's office, but okay. Tell me that that vet does not look like a gorilla. Okay, let's... That's a gorilla vet. I don't care who you are. That's a gorilla vet. Okay. Let's see. Let's do ooh, bath time. Let's see what little bath animation is. Okay. I keep wanting to go far away with this. 
So we've got that little animation. Okay. Let's see the next one. Ooh, roll over. So yeah, you get all these really cute animations. So it looks like as you do things in the um, the pet itself that you get to unlock more of these. So probably, oh, oh, he looks so sad. Is he in his pen or is he in doggy prison? I'm going to pretend it's doggy prison. He didn't file his taxes. So uh, yeah, don't file your taxes. You go to doggy prison. Hey, you're not special dog. You got to go to prison. Doggy IRS. Oh. Looks like you've taken a dump as we speak. Oh, that's the animation. Duh. So it looks like he even has a pooping animation. Oh my goodness. So anyway, um, this is the newest Giga Pets that have just come out. And uh, as more release, I will be buying them. I've already done my pre-orders for the uh, T-Rex and the Unicorn, which you can do on their website. Gigapets AR. Make sure to check them out on Instagram and uh, Facebook. It's um, really exciting time to see all of these come out, and they're always looking for suggestions and, and new updates. So I'm really excited and uh, so happy to see a bit of my childhood come back as something new. So uh, thank you guys for watching, and I will see you next time.